multiply, you're going to have the complex conjugate also as a zero. So this would be negative i, you would also have positive i. If it was 2 minus i, you'd have 2 plus i. So you have that conjugate. And then when you give, are given the zeros, the factors are going to be x minus the zeros. So we have x minus negative i, which is x plus i, and x minus i. Now what you can do is, I'd probably foil these together here first because you can see the inside and outside are going to cancel. This is going to give us x squared, and this is going to give us negative i squared. But we know i squared is negative 1 times a negative is positive 1. So we have x squared plus 1, and we have x minus 2. So now we just have to multiply these together. x times x squared is x cubed. x times 1 is x. Negative 2 times x squared is negative 2x squared, and negative 2 uh, times positive 1 is negative.